Well, it wasn't exactly the evening I'd planned, but it turned out to be pleasant enough. Frank is a very special person, isn't he? Yes, he certainly is, and he obviously thinks the same about you. Of course he does. We're friends. Dorothy, I hesitate to say this, but something in Frank's eyes says to me he, he thinks of you as more than just a friend. Blanche, the man is a priest. The man's a man. <laughs> I'm not going to listen to this. Listen, I know what I'm talking about because I was in a very similar situation once and he was a man of the cloth. Oh, totally dedicated to his vocation, or so he said. But his eyes told me he was dedicated to me. Now, we both knew it was wrong and we fought our feelings with ever bone in our hot, long and writhing bodies. <laughs> Finally, it was just too much for us and we gave up and checked into a Best Western. <laughs> You had an affair with a priest. Priest? I didn't say he was a priest. I said he was a man of the cloth. He was a fabric salesman. <laughs> you know, we never made love again after that, but he did cover my lazy boy for free. <laughs> Wonderful, Blanche. The point is, something in his eye says he wants you, and I think he means it in the biblical sense. I will not listen to this. <laughs> Coffee's <man. laughs> 